two months since the start of Operation Northern Cross. The Federation's elite forces, Squad E among them, were driving back the Empire one victory at a time. Yet, the further they cut into Imperial territory, the more tenuous the supply chain. And so, the Federation Army established a series of massive outposts along the front line. Among them, Lindbergh Base. Commanded by the 101st Division, this outpost would prove itself a vital logistics hub in the battles to come. All done, Claude. What do you think? Cool, right? Kind of exciting, isn't it? Once we're ready, let's come back and make something to strike fear into the Empire. Glad to see you're on time, Claude. Tour the base yet? Yeah. Compared to the old camps, this is heaven on Earth. Excellent. I expect you to put all this funding to good use. Sir, the commanders of squads A through I have assembled. Then let's get down to business. I know Squad E just arrived, but we already have marching orders. Our mission is to capture a small town northeast of here. According to reports, Rain is one of the enemy's most valued comm centers. Which is why it's being guarded by a tank platoon. That complicates things. Squad E is mostly infantry. Do we have the right equipment for urban and anti-tank warfare? Don't worry. This time you'll have fire support. Once you infiltrate the city, simply relay the tank's coordinates to the field artillery team. I see you already thought this through. We also received intel that the Empire is inflating their numbers with decoys. If we can discern the real tanks from the fake, Rain is as good as ours. Excellent work, Lieutenant. I'm glad I can depend on you. You flatter me, sir. <laughs> Impressed? Control info and you control the war. Join ops, huh? Coordinating with the fire support unit is gonna make or break this mission. <laughs> Try to minimize collateral damage. We plan on repurposing their gear for our own comm center. Minerva, you are to lure the enemy troops as far away from the city as possible. Consider it done. Squad E will then sneak in and gather intel for the field artillery team. Understood, sir. Yo, I hear we're moving out already. Oh, shame. I just scored a hot date with a Navy babe. <laughs> you wish. You got shut down. Oh. Uh, you were watching? Raz, what you do in your spare time is up to you. But when you're on duty, you represent the army. <laughs> Who are you, my mom? <laughs> Feels like it sometimes. Anyway, you said we'd have fire support. Does that mean it's a joint operation? You guessed it. <sighs> hey, looks like you're still alive. I'm glad you're okay too. They told me you'll be commanding my team. Oh, really? Well then, I look forward to... Spare me. I already requested a transfer. Uh, oh. But orders are orders. Until my transfer goes through, you're in charge. Not that I expect real leadership from a scaredy Claude. <sighs> what do you know, Riley come lately? You just got here. All bark and no bite as always. You mind shutting up while the grown-ups talk? What the hell? It's been ten years and that's how you greet an old friend? Hi there, Riley! I know it's not my business, but Claude... Uh, Lieutenant Wallace is a great commander. 
none of us would have made it this far without him. We trust him with our lives. And since we'll be working together, maybe you should... Uh... I should trust him? I'm sure it's all sunshine and rainbows while you're winning, but when the chips are down... Running away is probably all he could manage. Cut it out, Riley. <sighs> the Empire took your family from you, not Claude. He's grown up since then. Judge him for who he is now. Leave it be, Kai. But... It's all right. Words can't change the past. We'll just have to rebuild. Rebuild what? Our trust. Huh? Riley, I'm gonna show you how much I've changed. At least give me a chance to prove myself. Let's make one thing clear. Unless it's for the mission, I do not take orders from you. Riley... Give me a break. <laughs>